Tech TV, Experience Educational Television. The KNUSC College of Science, in collaboration with Wisdom and Danida Alumni Network, organized a two day seminar for females in the second cycle institutions from 20th to 21st June 2019 in the Abwaji Menya Complex building. On the first day, the Provost of the KNUSD College of Science, Professor Ibok Odru, gave a welcome address and an overview of the seminar. Thinking they are and working and making sure they don't have interest in science, but they have interest in other things. Secondly, as we moved along the ladder, as we moved from primary school to JHS, secondary school to tertiary to the top level. The number keeps reducing. The number keeps what? Reducing. We start with a lot of the girls. But by the time you get to my stage, the number has dwindled. So you have to be looking. Where are the ladies? Where are the ladies? Then we will see one doctor in the forest somewhere. Then we will pick her. We will see one doctor. So we decided that we have to work on the girls. Metro Director and Girl Child Coordinator of Ghana Education Service motivated the girls. Parenting efforts, captain ships, and other vessels, engineering, articulator driving, bus driving, laboratory assistants, astronauts, to mention just a few, are all professions that have been mystified and are generally perceived as a prison for the masculine. That was the past. Now, education has been through various transformations, and we are in the era of equity and inclusivity. Former Vice Chancellor of KNUSD, Professor Otu Ellis, spoke about having good dreams, developing positive attitudes towards academics and social life. To biologists, to chemists, to business people, to mathematicians. These are big positions, these are huge positions. I don't know your dream, I don't know your ambition, but I want you to look at them, and today I want you to start changing your mindset. I hope you understand me. Yes. Metro Director of Ghana Education Service in the Kumasi Metropolitan Assembly gave a presentation on various programs in the second cycle institutions and scholarship opportunities. We have programs, programs. The programs are put into groups. One program is agriculture. Agriculture, you call it agric. You also have technical, technical program. You also have general arts. Later in the day, the students went for a laboratory tour in the various labs in the College of Science. Tech TV News interview the Provost of KNUSC College of Science, Professor Ibok Odro. Partnership with Danida, alumni with the Danish Ministry, took a decision last year that we'll be writing proposals to see how we can help a girl child in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. So we had one last year, inspiring the next generation because we believe that science should be communicated from one generation to the other so that they can um, support the development of the nation. So that was very successful. So when there was a second call this year, um, the team also put a proposal together. And this time we decided to move from Ayedwasi RC to Kote 
RC school and then added a private school which is um, Rako school. So with the aim of still trying to see if we can inspire the girl child to be interested in uh, programs and career paths that have science, technology, mathematics, engineering as the basic foundation. The Metro Director and Girl Child Coordinator for Ghana Education Service spoke to Tech TV News. Uh, Metro is so interested in the program. So its doors are always open for whichever program that is brought to Metro. That's why it has allowed the schools to participate because they want them, they, it wants to expose the children to a lot of um, science careers to help them in the future. We have this annual STMIE camp that we organize for the students. When, it's, uh, when that time arrives, a higher percentage is given to girls, to that of boys. So that one too is in support of science program for the girls in the metropolis. Some teachers of the students interacted with Tech TV News. My name is Kwame Jose Dise, and from uh, Rako School Complex. Okay, so far um, since I came, I've heard um, some of the reasons why um, it's good for the girls, especially, to you know involve themselves in science and not have that kind of phobia. And I think uh, as they've also heard some of these messages from um, these women in science and who are already at this top level of in their career, um, I think it's, it's a good encouragement for them and it will also help motivate them. Their cooperation is very, very important and it will help us to be able to impact more to these young ladies coming up. Some of the girls spoke to Tech TV News. My name is Shroda Pia. I am in JHS School, a school of Rako School Complex. I learned that we should always be active in class and we should obey our teachers. Whatever they tell us, we should learn. And to learn science also, because science helps us to be a doctor in future. Thank you. I'm called Victoria. I attend school at St. Benedict Arrows. We should learn hard so that we can achieve success in the future. Tech TV, experience educational television.